Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. I am driving right now to Banff, Alberta, Canada. I'm staying at the Moose Hotel and Suites and I'm gonna take you with me. We're gonna have a little journey. We're gonna have some nice dinners. We are gonna do some shopping and I'm gonna show you around. This hotel is my favorite place to stay in Banff. Hands down, it's right downtown, so like you don't need to worry about taking a cab or like an Uber. I don't even think there is Uber in Banff, to be honest. But anyway, um, it's just amazing. There are rooftop hot pools. They have the Meadow Spa, which has a ton of different treatments you can get. They have Pacini Restaurant, so we're gonna eat. Uh, we're gonna eat dinner there tonight. I'm about to check out our room and show you around. Hand in hand, building castles out of sand, reaching for the grand. just checked out the room amazing amazing it if you're gonna be staying in the Rocky Mountains in Banff you need to stay here this is exactly the kind of I don't know it's like so cozy so warm the fireplace um, just the design of the entire hotel the timber frame it's insane it's so beautiful so just FYI if you're looking for the true Rocky Mountain Canadian experience this is where you need to be. <laughs> so we also have the Bankhead House booked. Uh, it's a century old house and I'm gonna take you through it right now. This is a photo of the house before the hotel was built. 
So I'm here in the corner house and it's also called the Bankhead house, but, and I, I didn't really know why, but it's because actually this home originally was in a little town called Bankhead and it was moved to Banff between, I think it's on Banff Avenue and Moose Street. Um, it was moved here in 1926 and was here for 90 years and in 2016 when they built the hotel they shifted the house built the hotel brought it back in or did something like that and now it remains here in the courtyard of the moose hotel and suites and it's amazing i always use that word <laughs> and it's just a really really unique thing uh, the first time i stayed here i had no idea it was here so it was shocking when we came around the corner and uh, <laughs> there's this little house in the middle, like smack dab in the middle of this hotel and super cool, like really, really cool. And um, yeah, unforgettable really. So it's really neat that they rent this place out to guests. I think there's a maximum occupancy of two people in this space, but um, it's massive. I think it's over 500 square feet. And I'm super excited about the clawfoot tub. I'm getting in that bad boy. Maybe not getting out, I don't know. crazy real quick out there I don't know what the deal is there must be like a major shift in the weather coming because it's not normally super windy here but it's like it's like a hurricane out there of the Moose Hotel and Suites uh, in the hot pools. And there are lots of guests here, so I can't like pan around, but look at the view we've got. Unbelievable. And I'm wearing my candy cane bikini. You all have seen in my red bikini try on haul. And I have a special guest who finally arrived. Here, okay, let me get this straight. So, Stella? Hey guys. <laughs> What's up? Uh, we're just chilling in the hot pools, and before we have dinner, we're gonna go for a nice dinner. And um, it's beautiful. It's, so, it's a little bit overcast. Here's the sky. But, but it's still gorgeous. It's nice and warm, and it was windy as hell today, but. We survived. We're from Alberta originally, so that's not unusual for us. But uh, we'll check in with you guys at dinner time. Maybe we'll film a bit when there are people that are like not all over the place. Because right now it's pretty in 
there's, there's quite a few people here, so. Uh, yeah, anyway, we'll check in with you later. One and a half bites, so let's get into it. 
we survived dinner. It was so good. <laughs> Not that we didn't expect to, but we had, <laughs> we had a really, really, really great dinner. Great wine, great service. Anything so to say? Good. It's delicious. How many prawns? linguine? I recommend it. Nine prawns? Eight prawns? <laughs> um, and I ate way too much pizza, way more than I normally would. But we had an amazing dinner and great service. I can't wait to eat here again. We'll probably be here for lunches, breakfasts, probably. Yeah, second yeah. breakfast. And we'll tune in with you tomorrow. Bye. Good morning, guys. I'm about to go and film in the spa. Look at the view. Actually, a really beautiful morning. It kind of snowed a bit last night, but it's going, it's going quickly. It's, it's actually still snowing a little bit right now, but um, I'm going to show you guys around the spa. There are some hot pools I'm going to hop into <laughs> and it's going to be really fun. Don't mind my breakout. It's annoying as hell. Annoying as hell. It's from a facial that I got. It's my own fault. I knew I shouldn't have. My feet are soaked. I'm wearing white socks. in here it just is something about um, reclaimed wood I know I'm not the only one out there that has interest in it and uh, it's just a neat feature so I keep cutting my head off <laughs> it's just a really neat feature to have in a spa right it kind of not only brings the outdoors in but it also has this feeling like it's been here for a long time
and I've ordered sunny side, oh my gosh, the lighting's sunny side up eggs, bacon, hash browns, and what else did I order? Food free bread. Coffee, orange juice. I tried to order a mimosa, but it's too early apparently. <laughs> Suit. I know I look rather naked right now, but I am not. We are holding an expensive camera over hot water and hopefully um, nothing bad happens. Oh, that's sort of but basically, part. we're in the hot pools right now. We're gonna try to film. It's actually busier than we expected. Yeah. Like, it's <laughs> like quite a bit. Yes, yeah, quite a bit. Uh, so, um, the view is incredible, of course, as you can see. <laughs> and <laughs> And we're gonna try to get some footage of the rest of the place without um, offending anybody. Yeah. <laughs> because we just sometimes do that naturally, yeah. And the rest of my body, but. Everybody's got swimsuits on? Good. <laughs> so guys, we are up here on the rooftop. Click, 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 down through the chimney. Yeah, anyway, uh, enjoying some sparkling water. And... Uh, <laughs> Um, I'm gonna go over to show you guys the seating area because there's actually a really neat fireplace and a place where you can sit. So even if you're in your swimsuit, you're still, you know, just keeping warm. So you could sit here and enjoy the campfire. It's not really a campfire, it's a gas fire, but you know. And it's actually, the view up here is crazy! Look! And this mountain here is also incredible. You zoom in on that. So there are two pools. There's one, I think they're the same temperature, and then the other. And that's about all I could show you because there are people everywhere. But okay. about to go have some good dinner at the Grizzly House. Are you ready? Come on, Stella. Make sure you turn up all the lights so we're okay. <laughs> we're gonna go have a good time. Uh, and just have fun with it. I do not know if you can hear anything 
that I'm telling you right now, but every time I come here, it's always a great time. I highly recommend the Rosie House. Just finished the massage, had a full body massage for one hour, uh, and holy crap, so great. Uh, then my face is probably super like swollen. That's what happens to me when I get massages. Like I, I'll have like a permanent line for like three days across my face. Uh, but tip, if you are getting a massage and you are like face down for a while, just move your face around a bit rather than keep it in one position the whole time because then you wind up with like cracks and creaks all over your face. Um, but so relaxing. The music they played, my massage therapist was like super amazing. And uh, you know, they ask you about pressure. Do you want more pressure, less pressure? So you never have to be nervous about somebody being too strong. You just always communicate with your therapist and it's no problem. The lighting is crazy. <laughs> so anyway, you guys, we're all packed up, we're packing up, and ready to head home from this amazing weekend. Huge thank you to Moose Hotel and Suites, and uh, the Meadow Spa, of course. I'm just over the moon about this whole experience. It's a beautiful day today. Uh, maybe we're gonna do a little bit of shopping before we head home, grab some lunch, definitely, and um, just dream over the next few weeks about the amazing time we had here, so. Um, if you guys are interested in checking out the Moose Hotel and Suites, I will have the website linked down below with all of the information you need, all of the different types of spa treatments are on their website, you can go check it out. And uh, it's just something to really look into and seriously consider. Banff is an amazing place to visit, so highly recommend that as well. You guys give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And um, don't forget to subscribe if you have not already. And as I mentioned, everything will be linked down below so you don't have to worry about finding out where we're at and all that good stuff. Make sure you're following me on Instagram and if you'd like access to some exclusive stuff, some members only type photos and videos, I post weekly there, weekly videos there, and um, lots of photos and all sorts of goodies, then check out my Patreon page. Go to www.patreon.com slash catwonders and check me out there. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in my next video.